good morning it's Thursday checking in on my p3 day 20 now let me just first start off I'm so excited because I got brought another hair binder to the car today so hopefully I don't have to hold on to it when I turn corners <laughs> So I was down a pound today. Tom appears to have left and I was down a pound. So that puts me at roughly three pounds under my LIW. So um, Ricky had mentioned, um, you know, why not just do P3 until I get back from my spring break and then do load and then do it after and it's like I want to be done by my birthday and I'm not sure honestly I'm like ready for a break from P3 <laughs> I'm ready to go back to you know more plain food and that kind of a thing this boy is wearing shorts again today it's like 23 degrees out anyway only in Minnesota right Sandy, do you get that in in Wisconsin too? Not that far. Anyway, um, I just want to be done. I want to get to. I would love to lose another twenty to thirty pounds. I don't really have a goal in mind. Um, I think you know quite frankly if I were to stay right around where I am now I'd be happy I'd be okay I should say not happy I'd be okay with it but I think I'd be happy 20 to 30 pounds down so that's why I want to I don't know that I would lose 20 in a short round or like a 30 day round I don't know that I would so for sure I think the way that I'm planning on doing it, I'll be okay. So, that is what I'm doing. So, I am loading this weekend. And that's the other thing, is that I've been mentally preparing myself for loading, aka load planning, <laughs> aka planning what I'm going to shove in my face. <laughs> yep. So, I think I, I would probably cheat if I didn't load, because I've just hyped it up. I know, I know. There's no reason why I couldn't start it this weekend just because Tom is gone now and I have the HCG, so ain't nobody gonna hold me down. <laughs> Break my whatever. I am such a goofball sometimes. So yesterday, oh my god, oh my god, you guys aren't going to believe this, oh my god, I made that Eggs Benedict and it was freaking fantastic, oh, yes, I took a picture, um, so I'll put it in, like right about here. the hollandaise sauce over it and oh my gosh it was good I have to go to the store and buy more eggs because I'm gonna have that for dinner tonight so that was my lunch yesterday my early lunch and it was fantastic 
And then for dinner, I had shoot, I forgot to bring some math nuts to work today. For dinner, I had um, squirrel moment there. For dinner, I had my I heated up another steak, my last steak that I had. It's a ribeye. Ate that with some blue cheese dressing. And some roasted, the roasted cauliflower and broccoli that I made with butter on it. That was my dinner. And then I did have some snacks throughout the day. I had a, I had some mac nuts. And I took that, when I bought that bag of mac nuts at um, Trader Joe's, I divided them up into the right size portions for the bag and put them in little baggies so that I could just grab one um, but also so I wouldn't sit down with the whole entire bag and go where'd that bag go <laughs> that's that's me can't be trusted so now it's like I'll grab a baggie and I'll eat them and if I want more I gotta get off my ass and go get them <laughs> and that's like that nah, ain't worth it <laughs> so yeah some mac nuts and I had a bag of um, the protein, the Quest protein uh, chips, crisps, whatever you call them. I had a bag of that and I think that was all I had yesterday. I did get water in, um, got my steps in, which is really a challenge when you're working from home trying to get my steps in because where do I have to go walk to? <laughs> the bathroom's like, you know, 10 feet away. It's like, well, that ain't where I'm going. <laughs> so, but I did it. So yeah. Um, suckers man you can do like four days <laughs> and before you know it you're up like 10 pounds over your LAW you're like damn it yep I got that t-shirt can you tell oh my god you guys grow the flip up this guy is like 
got to go to the right to the left. Oh, there's cars there. Yeah. Annoying. And, uh, yeah. I don't really have a lot of stuff coming up planned. Um, you know, like work trips or anything. So it'll be a good time to also get it started. Um, they did plan a happy hour for next week, for Thursday. Um, however, my daughter has her IEP meeting for her speech services. Um, so I think I might just ditch out on it and not even go. I know they're not going to be happy. So my boss at my review told me that I, I make the place fun. So does that mean that without me it won't be fun? It'll be a bit different different, uh, what do you call it, atmosphere, I know that. <laughs> so, whatever, don't have to deal. And it's supposed to be beautiful here this weekend, so I'm looking forward to that. My daughter has an all-day babysitting camp on Saturday, and then a cookie booth Saturday night. And then we got nothing Sunday, so we're going to go to the, uh, what do you call it, the Japanese... Thursday, tomorrow's Friday, the day we've been waiting for all week, woo, woo, right? So I will check in tomorrow and let you know how I did. I brought my lunch today, so I'm going to.